chemical engineer works in energy and oil industries, biotechnology, petroleum refinery to turn crude oil into gasoline, jet fuel, diesel fuel. So, what chemical engineers do? What are the major subjects studied? Should you take chemical engineering degree? The chemical engineer deals with designing equipment, systems and processes for refining raw materials and for mixing, compounding, and processing chemicals. Chemical engineers are in great demand because of the large number of industries that depend on the synthesis and processing of chemicals and materials. What does it take to be chemical engineer? Chemical engineer combines a background in chemistry with engineering and economics concepts to solve technological problems. Critical skills needed in chemical engineering are an in-depth understanding of chemistry, mechanical engineering, and fluid dynamics. Chemical engineers' jobs require at least a bachelor's degree in chemical engineering, and many employers also require state certification as a professional engineer. A master's degree is often required for promotion to management, and ongoing education and training are needed to keep up with advances in technology, test equipment, computer hardware and software, as well as government regulations. Chemical engineer works in energy and oil industries, biotechnology, pharmaceuticals, electronic device fabrication, environmental engineering, petroleum refinery to turn crude oil into gasoline, jet fuel, diesel fuel, lubricating oil, solvents, petrochemicals, at a fertilizer plant to produce ammonium nitrate, or at a personal care product manufacturer to mix dozens of ingredients to produce shampoo and skin lotion. Your work as chemical engineer also includes ensuring compliance with health, safety, and environmental regulations, conducting research into improved manufacturing processes, designing and planning equipment layout, incorporating safety procedures for working with dangerous chemicals. Sorry, that was not intended to scare you of monitoring and optimizing the performance of production processes, as well as estimating production costs. What is the salary of chemical engineer? According to Salary.com, as of July 2014, the salary range for a newly graduated chemical engineer with a bachelor's degree is $53,493 to $82,127. The range for a mid-level engineer with a master's degree and 5 to 10 years of experience is $72,520 to $113,348. The subjects that chemical engineer studies are applied mathematics, material and energy balances, thermodynamics, fluid mechanics, energy and mass transfer, separations technologies, chemical reaction kinetics, biochemical engineering, polymer science and technology, solid waste management, chemical reaction engineering, reactor design, and process design. The main ones you use in the field being chemical engineering thermodynamics, mass transfer operations, and chemical reaction engineering, which includes derivation of rate expressions from reaction mechanism, ideal reactor types, integral method of analysis, differential method of analysis, principles of chemical reactor analysis and design, experimental determination of rate equations and so on. After completing chemical engineering degree, you are encouraged to obtain a license, but it is not always required, as it is for many other engineering professions. Licensing generally requires a degree from an accredited engineering program, passing scores on fundamentals of engineering, and principles and practice of engineering exams, and four years of engineering experience. You may ask, what happens before getting the license? Entry-level chemical engineers, before they get their license, typically work under the supervision of more senior engineers. They may advance to supervising teams of technicians or other management positions. Is this career a good fit for you? Chemical engineers typically work in manufacturing plants, research laboratories, or pilot plant facilities. They work around large-scale production equipment that is housed both indoors and outdoors and are often required to wear personal protective equipment, such as hard hats, goggles, and steel toe shoes. A typical workday for a chemical engineer working in a plant may involve traveling from one function to the next within a facility. As chemical engineer you acquire computational skills, design skills, communication skills, for better interaction in the plant, rational ability to quickly solve problems, also interacting with other people who are part of a team is critical to the success of projects. What course are you currently in? Do you find it interesting? What subjects do you enjoy the most? Let me know down in the comments. If you're interested in sharpening your knowledge and becoming a more proactive person, subscribe to the channel today and share this video to your friends.